Hi guys, if you are finding a video about how to make a power bank or a portable charger, then this will be a great video for you. Now let me show you where's my power bank. This is my power bank, and my, uh, let me show you introduce to the materials what I require for this. First of all, I, re I re uh, will require a switch, the a switch, tac uh, tac or joystick type switch like this and a multiple switch for shifting the uh, about three minimum uh, sliding switch should be of uh, minimum three uh, three wires you can finish uh, four wires sorry i'm sorry four wires one two three and four you can see now okay now let me show you about what parts i will require and remember this is also a ac main switch so you can cut it from any diwali light or any power sockets okay let me show you what I actually the parts which I require okay. okay guys this is the charger a battery charger mobile battery charger which you can uh, in which you can charge the one uh, 3.7 volts lithium ion or lipo lipo battery and if you have seen my earlier video I have shown you this kind of cases these cases and this is ca these cases are of car charger which I've used in earlier video. Actually, what happened was uh, in earlier video was that my nine volt battery was sufficient, but it was uh, uh, you can say it dis uh, it discharged and I have to buy a new battery for my charger. So I shifted to the lipo battery, lipo rechargeable batteries. These are, there are three lipo rechargeable batteries: one, two, and three. All are of different potential. I will suggest you to buy. Uh, 3000 mAh lipo battery so that you can get a 9000 9, mAh power bank and it will charge by using this switches you can see LED glows can you see the LED screen ok I can show I think yes it is so now let me tell you about how I have uh, taken out these these and this ok guys now putting it aside and show you about the circuit diagram what is the circuit diagram for this consider now let me show you what is the circuit consider this is the my charger or i can say a car charger this this is the car charger this they let it be uh, my car charger and this is be the usb female a large one remember a large one this is the large one which you will connect the data cable <laughs> I'm sorry my drawing is not good but as it is a circuit diagram so it will be accepted and this will go to our phone my writing is also very bad I'm so sorry <laughs> and these are the positive and negative terminals output input sorry input which i'm going to connect in, uh, with my three lipo batteries this is my first lipo battery this is my second lipo battery and this is my third lipo battery okay and these are their terminal respective terminals let it say it is positive negative positive negative positive negative now i'm connecting to uh, all these three batteries these are of 3.7 volts battery all all are 3.7 volts and i have to require i'll require uh, for my charger to up to 12 volts so i'm getting it 11.1 uh, volts about this when you will connect these batteries in series like this like this and when you connect this to the terminals respective terminals the charger will work but now the condition main problem is about how to charge these batteries so i have used this type of charger this is this this is the mobile battery charger you can buy it from any electrical shop this is and open it and take out these terminals remember uh, your ac mains will be always lie downwards and uh, your battery dc voltage will lie always upwards like these red wires are of uh, dc and ac mains are of these so let me show you how I have connected to the multiple switch 
I will get my positive wire from here. Let me show you. Now guys, I have made a 3D diagram for you. You can see this is a 3D diagram for the switch. These all are my downwards and these all are my upwards. Now I'm going to connect these to the this wire to get a perfect potential. Okay guys, I have made a diagram. This is my charger. This one, this. And these are the AC mains which you, you have to insert in the plug. And uh, these are my battery charging. So let me connect these to this and all the batteries to this okay first of all um, connect these positive to the end one about down downwards to the multiple sliding switch and um, a negative one to the uh, upward downwards uh, upward sliding switch and these are the middle ones which you uh, which will connect now guys main connections this wire is behaving as a negative for this one so i'm going to connect this wire to my upward terminal of multiple sliding switch and as this wire is behaving as this common wire is behaving positive for my next battery so i'm going to connect this one if you will connect to um, this uh, take another wire from here then it will be so much of messy type things so i'm connecting from here to uh, wire to here wire so it is upward wire and going to positive one this is my positive wire so <coughs> and you can see this is negative one and now i'm going to connect this negative to the upward as my upwards are negative and downwards are my positive so this is my negative one this is positive this is negative this is the common wire which is uh, positive and negative for both so this one negative for the upward battery negative for the upward battery and positive for the downward battery negative for the upward and positive for the downwards and this is the this one is negative for the upward and now i'm going to connect this wire to straight away this remember you do, you will you would not have to connect uh, simply wire, wire by here as this is the main switch which you will connect here here and here so this wire will go to add uh, this is post negative for the uh, this second one battery and uh, positive for the other and we know positive is our upward so this is a positive this is negative all the connections are over now main thing is now we have to connect these two terminals which are left to the negative to the respective terminals we remember our downwards is positive and upwards are negative so connect this positive to this and connect this positive sorry this negative to this this all the connections are very easy you can make this charger and let me know how you made let me show you is this work or not so let me bring my phone which i will show you uh, is this work or not guys i've missed something these are switches you have to connect switch from one from one switch here this is, is switch one switch here and one switch will be here or i can say key this is a switch i have also made this one by this switch okay these are my main switch and these are my other switch okay now let me show you my charger works or not keeping it aside and giving a phone this is my phone this this is my phone i've connected my data cable to my charger and switching on connecting the wire data cable to my phone and phone states that charger connected let me show you it states or not charger connected and this is nothing but hair only you can see and while switching off and let me show you is this uh, charge get charged from the AC mains or not okay guys I'm taking this to the switch switch board 
message board is here guys i've connected my charger and uh, sorry and i'm on switching out it on and this is my charging for this and the charger seat side is working switching it off shifting it to the other side switching it on again it's charging switching it off again shifting to other side switching it on hope you enjoyed my video thanks for watching this video and please subscribe and share thanks for watching thank you